well, it's all gone Brendorific around here. Completely crazed. And we are keeping calm and we are carrying on. Anyway, it's Monday the 4th of. What month are we in? June. It stopped raining. It's cool. <laughs> there you go. And I'm off to Cardiff. And I'm going to video some more castles. Because they've been deluged with the comments. Okay, when I say deluged, I've had to. Yay for the social networks. So, next up, I'll probably have a little look at the Rumney River. That's Rumney with a Y. And here we are coming up to what was the border between Glamorganshire and Monmouthshire. And nowadays this is all Caerphilly. And on the Monmouthshire side. Monmouthshire used to be in England. It's all rather confusing. Well, not really. So, is the river up? This is the River Romney, and yes, it's up. So, I'm not following the sign, I'm following the sign for Caerphilly Castle. Right, I need to get back to this day in tech history, Mr. Geoffrey Powers. More castle? And I'm listening to Mr. Ewan Rankin now, with the Max Stroke Big Show, talking about Guinness, Stouts and Porters. And this is Caerphilly Council in action. 26th of May, and now it's the 4th of June. Good stuff, boys. Oh no. Oh no. Why isn't it open in the middle of the night? Probably because it's not as stupid enough to get up in the middle of the night. So this is public transport on a bank holiday. Well, actually, this is buses. There's a bit of luck the trains are running. Unless, of course, they shut as they were yesterday. There were buses all over the place. And it's yet another Class 150 going to Bargoid. Short.
to the front of the top of the back of this mountain. I wonder if it was. And it's there. There's a inner and older castle. And a mount with a mortar, as I said. This is St. Mary Street, Cardiff. Listen to Twit, 356. This is the Prince of Wales. And a cup of coffee. And all you can tell, I'm posting to Posterous. Posterous. And out there, it's not raining. So there we are, that's coffee. And now on my way to the gatekeeper, which does not until late. And we're in a point in the camera too now. It's the golden the legend stadium now. But I used to work there. And actually, there's this gate three and the other side of the road because it was there. So we're going up here, not over there. There's a bus stop outside Spoons. It's handy. And he'll try to know where got it. This is Black Dog. Dull joke about Led Zeppelin. L goods 3.6% alcohol by volume. Mm. Nice but rather watery. And chocolatey afterwards. B plus. Thing number two. Jubilee IPA. I wonder what that's about then. 4.8%. Alcohol by volume, he sort of scratches his head from the Leeds Brewery. And my worry is a sip of it. This is not an IPA, this is remarkably lemony. Yeah, cheers to that. Now, IPA is supposed to be alcoholy and bittery. Yes, yeah, very lemony. This will give it a B, plus, but it's not an IPA. And then my number three. And number three is a cider from just up the road. I think it's Lamprey Vardra. <coughs> Winter Drive. It's six and a half percent alcohol by volume. A still cider. It's um, medium. Actually, it's a bit medium sweet. Six and a half though. You burn that through the bottom of my stomach and I'll be fast asleep. Ooh. Well, the forecast for tomorrow kind of looks a bit soggy. Anyway, he says. Minimal carbonation. It's nice, actually, but I still move. Only just a B plus.